So the Sephora Family and Friends sale was a couple of days ago and I ordered a couple of stuff. I was able to find a friends and family code on Reddit, but I got a couple of things that I've been wanting for a long time. This is the Drunk Elephant Baby Facial. It's like the exfoliant and I love the packaging. It's cute and pink. Also picked up this Caudalie Micellar Cleansing Water because I was running out of the one that I've been using and decided to just try this one because I've heard great things about it. Picked up this Charlotte Tilbury Mini Lip Set. This is in the shade Pillow Talk. I believe it comes with the lip gloss, lip liner, lipstick. I don't know, maybe that's like a lip plumper or something, but yeah. The Inky List Caffeine eye cream because I'm still on the search for a good eye cream. This one was like decent in reviews and really really um, affordable so I'll let you guys know if I like it or not. And then I also picked up this Marc Jacobs bronzer because it was actually on sale. I don't know if they're discontinuing it or something but this is in the shade Tantastic and it has really really nice packaging. Welcome back to a new vlog. Right now I am at my fam's house because I'm gonna do my sister's lashes for her birthday. She's not gonna be here for a couple hours, but I just uh, came here early so I can get some homework done. My stepdad made Ilaga, which is a Filipino soup with green beans. It's like a sweet and sour, or not sweet and sour, like a sour soup. It's pretty good. Where's Mr. Dobby? There's Mr. Dobby. He is very, very hyper right now. He hyper. Hmm. Very hyper. Lacey still does not like him as much. I mean, she's okay with him, but she just like. Yeah. He wants to play with her so bad, but she's like, nope, no thank you. And then we have Rango here. I don't know if I ever showed you guys, but they got a bearded dragon. I think, uh, was it two months ago? Almost two months ago. He's gotten so big. His name is Rango. We actually don't know if he's a boy or girl yet, but <laughs> he was he used to be like half this size. Now he's like really, really growing. Um, Dobby's eating. I just fed him his crickets. I'm like pretty hungry, so I'm going to go ahead and eat some food. Whenever I come here, they always have this pile of snacks here on the counter, and I always get so tempted. Last time I was here, I was eating these chicken biscuits, which reminded me of when I used to work at Fred Meyer, which is a grocery store, and Nigel and I would always get the most random snacks, and this is one of the ones we would always get. Let's see, there's this one, it's a Filipino, like, cookie, ghost pepper chips, chicharron. These apparently are, like, Filipino version of Ritz crackers. gonna have a whole bunch of green beans. At um, Nigel's family's house, we only eat brown rice. So the only time I ever eat white rice is when I'm here or if we're like eating out or something. Just finished doing my sister. She just left, and I'm about to pack everything up. They left Lila here too because they're gonna be back later. Oh, poor Lila. My sweet little girl. My sweet girl. 
You jealous? You jealous? Hmm? You jealous? Hmm? We're being fuck? bad this weekend, guys. He ordered some habit. I got some fries and a burger. Now I got a shake and onion rings. I'm just sitting here trying to finish up my homework while Nigel's playing his new favorite video game. It's popping right now. Everyone knows this game. Hey guys, good morning. I'm making some lunch. I just woke up because I did not have a good sleep. Lacey kept us up almost all night again, but I'm trying to use up some old ingredients that I had. So I'm gonna make some garlic noodles with um, some seafood. the recipe from this girl on Instagram. Her name is Tway. I'll show you guys real quick. This is her Instagram. She's like a big foodie and posts like recipes sometimes but um, if you click on her story right here that says garlic noodles then you'll find the video of her making it. So that is what I did. Um, the only thing I didn't add that she added is parmesan. I'm gonna have my lunch and then I'm gonna do homework. Today we're actually celebrating my sister's birthday. There might be some confusion if you guys watched my last vlog, but tomorrow is actually my sister Sharina's 21st birthday. And then um, in the vlog where I was celebrating my other sister's birthday, she was turning 12. I have two sisters in case you guys were confused. So since today is Sunday, this is usually the day that I will plan out my week when it comes to like school or pretty much just everything. So the first thing I do is I kind of prioritize um, what I need to do for school because I really got to think about which assignments are going to take multiple days to do and stuff so I'm not like cramming everything into one day. So I do use Canvas for my school. My classes are online and I look at the calendar and look at the week that I'm on, so 18 through 19. And then I will click on each assignment and kind of get a feel for how long it's gonna how long it's gonna take to finish. And then plan out my week accordingly. And then I also take my little color key out because sometimes I tend to forget um, what colors for each day. So let me see what I have to do today. I kind of have a lot to do. And then Okay, so let's see. So chapter 9 is due tomorrow. I'll take out the colors that I need to for my classes. So in that case, I have purple, blue, and then pink. Okay, so chapter 9 is due tomorrow. I need to turn that in. So I'll do that. Chapter 9. done filling out the week I think I am gonna be out of town for the weekend that's why I highlighted these three days so that's why a lot of the other days are kind of packed because I'm trying to get everything done so I don't have to worry about it on the weekend but 
After that, I'm just gonna take some stickers. I've been using these oat milk drops for the month of October, and I like to use this to mark like birthdays or like really special or important events. But I'm gonna mark my sister's birthday because her birthday is on Monday, Saturday, which is my best friend's birthday. Okay, and then that's pretty much it. So here's what the week looks like. I hate how it's kind of bare right here, but <laughs> what else am I gonna do, right? So that is that. I also have this little list right here on every week that has priorities and I like to fill that out as well. So I think my priorities for the week, I need to buy my Halloween costume. And then I also need to get all my homework done prioritize cleaning the room because our clean because our room has been pretty messy like i have this pile of stuff right here because of all the gifts and birthdays and stuff so happy birthday oh, how old are you today 21 wow look at all these decorations they did i didn't even get that this is her cake because she asked for coconut cake and then here's our drinks our favorite. What are you making, Mom? Noise. I made adobo. Uh, I made some broccoli, and I'm gonna make spaghetti. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, okay. hey, what are you doing? So we've got adobo. You like adobo, Sharina? Yeah. Watch out, dog! Um, beef steak, and then. KFC. Oh my god, we put Lila here. She sat there. Lila! Right. You're scared. Yeah. What's wrong, baby? Is Zombie bullying you. Where's dad? This is Rango. Chilling. Cut it. Can I cut it? You can get a cut. I want the chocolate. Uh, <laughs> 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 That's fair. Or the slice. Are you shaking? <laughs> <laughs> I was trying my best. <laughs> Oh, little doobie. Oh, oh that's cute! Oh my god! It's a oh, that's so cute! Oh, it's oh, there! Oh. It's there. Oh. Okay, Sabrina. <laughs> Which one do you want me to open first? The little one. The little one. Take it back when I said nice wrapping. <laughs> I know. <laughs> no, I'm the worst wrapper in the world. It's cute though. No. <laughs> the the wrapping is from Dollar Tree. Is that cute? The wrapping? Yeah. Yeah. Why do you it? I don't know how to wrap, okay? Blot and glow up touch. Oh, rare beauty! Oh! Aww. What is it? Rare beauty. It's Selena Gomez's um, makeup brand. I really Aww. want it. How do you zoom in on this thing? Oh, that's a lot. I thought that Well, they're sharing. I don't really drink shots that day. Hello. <laughs> Easy. Just watch the dream. Yeah. Oh my 
<laughs> wow, I drink. Guys, we just made it back home a couple hours ago and we've just been chilling. But I'm winding down now and I actually wanted to share with you guys the book that I'm currently reading. Um, I don't know if I told you guys, but I've been trying to read at least 20 minutes every single night. Sometimes I read more if it's if my book is getting really interesting but i have been reading mostly on my ipad which actually i don't really prefer i, I love reading actual books um more than anything just because i love the feeling of like having a book in my hand and turning the pages and stuff but i just have so many books already and have no room for any more so that's why i've just been buying all my books on my ipad but when we do move out and have more space i definitely want to start reading actual books again i don't know if i ever told you guys how much i actually love reading but over the past couple of years i just haven't been doing it much because of different reasons but i remember reading was like my number one favorite thing when i was growing up as a kid and my grandma who is one of the closest people to me in my life she used to take me to barnes and noble um every time she picked me up after school and she let me pick out a couple books and i just have like a lot of good memories with her and like books and all that because she's the one that got me into reading as well as one of my aunts who i haven't really spoken to in a while but she really got me into harry potter like the books and stuff but anyways i just wanted to share that with you guys in case um you know that's like something new that you don't know about me but so my most recent book that i finished was this one right here little fires everywhere by celeste nung or i don't know how you say her name but um i started reading this because i had watched the tv series on hulu and i really really loved the tv show but this book i don't know what it was about it i just didn't really enjoy it that well um, like it was just a mediocre book to me but right now I'm reading right now I'm reading The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo this was a recommendation by Jen M and I'm loving it so far I'm just a sucker for romance fiction those type of books as well as like I love mystery and thriller as well but this one is definitely like a romance fiction sort of book and as you're curious what it's about Evelyn Hugo is like this famous actress and she is well known for um marrying seven times and then she meets this journalist and she wants this journalist to write pretty much like her whole story behind all her marriages and stuff so she kind of just talks about her marriages and what it was like having a relationship with all of her husbands and stuff and there's just like a lot more to it but it's a really really good book so far i'm like a little bit more than halfway done i want to try to finish this by the end of the week So Nigel and I didn't have time to do groceries this week and also since we're leaving for the weekend there's really no point in us getting a bunch of groceries so I just ordered myself a little lunch. This is a poke bowl. I tried to make it as healthy as possible with mixed greens, cucumber, cucumber kimchi, edamame, seaweed salad, and then there's brown rice and all salmon because salmon is my favorite fish. So. And then I think I just got ponzu sauce for the sauce. Okay guys, happy Thursday. This vlog was kind of all over the place. I don't even know if it was too short or too long. But I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog with showing you guys my best friend's birthday gifts that I promised I would show you. Because I'm going to try to post this vlog by Friday night or Saturday. We'll see. 
But um, Nigel's gonna wrap them for me because, as you guys know, I'm very terrible at wrapping. So, yeah, um, I got her these two things. Let me just say, my best friend Davina, she's very, very like one of the most generous people I know. So, since it's her special day, I just wanted to get her some like really nice stuff because for my birthday, she did a lot for me and she also helped plan my engagement, all that stuff. So, she deserves the stuff. So, yeah, so happy birthday to her. But I ended up getting her this little dry bar set from Sephora. It comes with an interchangeable crimper and then two sizes of different wands, a brush, and then some hair products. And then this is the more special gift. I actually got her the same little card holder that she got me, but in the black color because she's more of like a neutral type gal. So it's really, really pretty. And then, so this is a gift that me, Nigel, and our friend Jimmy split on because it's a pretty big gift. So we got her this jacket from Canada Goose. Okay. And you can go ahead and pull it out. It's this really nice like black fall jacket. It looks really cute on. This view doesn't really give it any, <laughs> yeah. But it like cinches in the waist and the inside is all lined. So it's super soft and super warm. It comes with a hanger and like one of these things. I don't know what you call it. And it comes with a really nice box. So that is what we got her for her birthday. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I'm gonna end it here. I'm not gonna show my face cause I don't look that great right now. So um, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you wanna see more content. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.